Hi everyone, Rosie and I have got a small haul to show you today. We went to Meadow Hall, which is a big shopping centre about an hour away from us, from us. And we went in the Disney store and Rosie has been saving her money to buy Ooh. Disney Descendants. Ooh. Uma, you're so excited to have her, aren't you? <laughs> yeah, she's from... Disney Descendants 2, she's Uma and she's a baddie, isn't she? Because she kidnaps Ben, doesn't she? She's yeah, she's a pirate. She's a pirate. And she's the daughter of Ursula. Ursula, yes. So that's her. Who else have you got to show us, Rosie? One more, Dolly. This is Dizzy. Um, Dizzy. Next we have Dizzy. And Dizzy's been redressed. I got this outfit from... Um, home bargains it was $1.99 and we thought that it would match Dizzy really well as she's an artist so and also she's, not, she's a hairdresser she's a hairdresser right but she also is an artist isn't she yeah yeah she and does. so she's got her paintbrush look and she even comes with her paint palette which she can hold because we've put her on a different body haven't we Rosie wanted her on, on a made to move body so we've actually put her on a um Bratzilla body, yes, because it was the only one we could find. Yeah, so that's her. And then what? She's got three paintbrushes. Yeah, the outfit came with three paintbrushes and a paint palette, and that which is really good suits her very well, doesn't it? Yeah. So then, from the Disney store, I got Moana. I've been wanting a um, Barbie-sized Moana. Yeah, this is the one from the Disney store. Isn't she lovely? packaging turns into a boat look you turn your packaging into a boat it says right i'm not sure whether we'll do that or not but anyway on the back it's got moana and what's his name rosie can you remember maui maui that's it yeah and the little piggy what's the piggy called poa po poa poa yeah Something like that. And the chicken. What's the chicken called? I can't remember. I can't remember what any of them are called. I have seen it though, yeah. Aren't they cute though? Yeah, I really like that. Packaging turns into a boat. Pop out boat from packaging to recreate scenes from the movie. Very good. Instructions inside. Yeah, so that's her. Look how pretty she is. I love Moana. She's got a necklace on, she's got a lovely skirt, her hair's beautiful, she's got her paddle. She's lovely. She really is so she's happy with her. And then we went to Toys R Us and I got, I've been after this doll for ages, and she was in Toys R Us for £21, but I had a £5 off voucher, so she was actually £16. So I thought that was a good price and I got her. Yeah, she's got all her accessories. She's got her wristband. She's got her phone. She's got her glasses. She's got that very fancy skirt and top. And it says rad dance tracks there. She's got a little alien bag and some very sensible shoes to wear at festival. Yeah, she looks great, doesn't she? I absolutely love this girl. I don't know what it is about her. I think it's the rainbow leggings and the rainbow skirt that that attracted me to her yeah i do love the rain bright rainbow colors and i think this is a bracelet for you to wear yeah the handle it's not like made of rainbow ribbon yeah and then finally i got the these one. two um so holt jackson jekyll rather not why do i keep wanting to call him holt hyde oh that's why jekyll and hyde yeah jackson jekyll and he comes with frankie and now, I can't remember what they were called now. What were they called, Rosie? Can you remember? Frankie. Yeah, I know it's Frankie and Jackson, but what did it say on the back? What did it say? It said on the ticket where you bought them, it did tell you what, what line it was from, but I've completely forgotten. Anyway, that's those two. And there's the artwork on the back of their box. Yeah, so I can show you that a bit better. Yeah. That's that. Look like they're going on a picnic, don't they? I can't for the life of me remember what they what they were called. Some oh, no, I can't remember. Something like 
Oh no, I really cannot remember. Yeah, but obviously they're going on a date because they're going on a picnic look and she's got her cake and that and yeah. She's all dressed up in a pretty little skirt. Um, I'm sure what that is in the corner. It looks like a brush. Yeah, looks like they've got a brush and a s one, if not two stands. It doesn't actually say, but I will open them and we'll have a look. Okay. Okay. So here are the dollies out of the box. First, we've got um, Festival Vibes Jade. Um, lovely doll. Absolutely love this doll. Let's see if I can get a better. Yeah. I love her clothes. She's got blue and purple and pink, not purple, blue and pink streaks in her hair. She's got on a fluffy monster hood. She's got a see-through skirt on, which reminds me of one of those old brollies. She's got her rainbow leggings on and her massive shoes, which you need if you go into a festival. Yeah, that makes her tall enough to see the stage and it stops her feet getting muddy, yeah. But look how wonky her ponytails are. <laughs> One's down here and one's up there, look. <laughs> Bit of a flaw there. Never mind, never mind. And I thought I'd show you the other dolls on the back of the box. I would like to get some of the other ones. I particularly like Yasmin and Sasha. Yeah. They're cute, aren't they? You can get Raya, Yasmin, Sasha, Chloe. And then I've just got Jade. Yeah. Jade was the one I really wanted. I've been wanting her for ages, so really pleased to get her. She also came with all of these accessories. She came with glasses, which I stupidly cut one of the arms off when I was cutting the cardboard. I cut like that and cut the arm off the glasses. I could kick myself for that. But she came with a phone, a phone case, an armband, some earrings, another outfit. I love that outfit. A pink brush lip brush and a little alien bag which is a backpack so cute yeah she's got lots of accessories she's lovely apart from how wonky i can't get over how wonky they are it's not just a bit wonky it's very wonky can you see one's right down there and i've tried no there's no I'll, I'll have to take a hat off and redo it if i'm gonna yeah if i can't get over the fact that her ears are wonky <laughs> Then we have Jackson Jekyll and Frankenstein with their pick from the picnic set. Here's Jackson. He's his hair is really stiffly gelled to his head. And look at it looks a bit odd to me there. Looks like an old man, don't he? I don't like that style at all. Yeah, I think it needs to be. I think I need to give his hair a good wash and restyle it because I just I don't like it. it reminds me of a, an old man. And he's got his yellow glasses on the top of his head. He's got his yellow, his fringe is yellow underneath. He's got hair on his face. He's got his eyebrow pierced. He's wearing a blue top with a, what looks like a world, no, a yin yang on it. And he's got a grey and paler grey cardigan on. Please excuse my doggies. And then he looks like, when he came in the box, he was like this. So he looks like he's dropping all of the drinks and cakes look yeah and he's got some very creased yellow trousers and some gray shoes with a yin yang on to match his top yeah that's him he's nicely articulated got nice big hands and yeah very slim he is and he's got a, he's got an unusual face hasn't he i like that i just hate that hair i hate it it's horrible i'm gonna have to put him in the wash and wash him aren't i then frankie Frankie is beautiful as always. I love Frankie. She's got on some like lightning bolt earrings. I'd, I'm not very keen on her dress to be honest. She's got on a grey cardigan. It, look, it looks cheap, cheap and tacky to me. Yeah, I, I don't know whether it's just me, but the material's really flimsy and oh dear, excuse me, my dogs are going mental. She's got a yellow bow around her waist and a little yellow collar. I mean, it's a, it's pretty. It's just really, do you know what I mean? It's flimsy and look how the at the sleeves look. It's like really, it it's not very well finished. Yeah, I like her shoes. She's got black shoes and the heels are like a bolt. They're nice, aren't they? Yeah, and she's got the little picnic basket. She's holding that. I don't know if you can open that. I think, does it open each side? Yeah, you can open it, yeah. 
yeah so that's those two and they came with um a stand each a male one and a female one and a brush yeah so that was good and i mean it was that set was um 20 pounds so it was it was really was a bargain I thought that was a really good price for that yeah and then finally i have moana and i moana is beautiful i love moana she's one of my favorites and i say that about all of them but it's true i love them all she comes with her little dress on it's a velcroed velcroed wrap over dress and underneath it's got like this i'm not sure what this is in aid of to be honest but it's got like tassels underneath it like a grass skirt i suppose i don't know she's got an orange sash around the waist her necklace is nice it's like quite thick and yeah it's plastic but and she's got really she's really she's a really sturdy doll and her hair is beautiful look at her hair i love her hair it's beautiful I love the skirt as well. The detail in that skirt is really nice. It look, reminds me of like a rush mat. Yeah, I've just pulled that out of there, haven't I? That little, let's cut that off. Yeah, that's her wrap over skirt. And she's got, she doesn't come with shoes because obviously she's a, she doesn't need them in the sand. But yeah, she's lovely, really lovely doll. I like her top as well. Her top matches her sash. And she's looking off to the side as the Disney dolls often are. Yeah, she's really lovely, isn't she? really like her. And I did, and she came with her oar, which is really sturdy. And although I think that top bit is hollow, yeah. And it's got a handhold so she can hold it, although she can't hold it very well, but she can hold it. And then out of the box, I made the, the boat. Now, it, it, it was a bit, it's straightforward to make the boat, but it, it doesn't tell you how to do it. It just shows you. <laughs> Yeah, it's got a little, this is like the counterbalance bit, I suppose, that goes on the side. And I'd lost this, I'd already thrown this bit in the bin. Yeah, because it doesn't actually, if you can see, it doesn't show you how to do it. It doesn't tell you how to do it, it just shows you. And I was really confused about this bit here. Did you cut the bottom off the big bit? Anyway, I found it, I'd thrown it in the bin. It was a bit that came off the end here. Yeah, anyway, I got the boat made. There we are. So it would be good, you know, for a child to play with it would be great, wouldn't it? Yeah. And then you're supposed to use twigs to attach the little bit to the side so you've got, you know, the balanced, so it's balanced. Yeah, I shan't bother, shan't bother doing that, but I just wanted to show you that it, it, it can be done because I've done it. Yeah. Yeah, so that was our little haul for today. I hope you enjoyed that. Thank you for watching and bye for now.